I'm gonna be. Is the match gonna be delayed by like five seconds or perhaps or like five three seconds? Let like, me reiterate. This is an offline tournament. Yeah, this, this is offline. <laughs> All inputs are happening in real time. The player, <laughs> what the players see is what is happening. <laughs> it's like, man, I, I swore I held shield. No it's shenanigans like, here. Nah, I'll still be shenanigans. Perhaps the Johns will be a bit less valid. Potentially, we'll see. I guess there's Fujin off to, a, off to a great start there. There's a couple of back airs, and that's actually going to connect. Flying so well. That Phantom will cover so much, but oh. did not want to get caught in that. What, what, what just happened? Oh, it teleported under the stage. Oh, that's such unfortunate luck for Fujin. He was playing so well within the first 30 seconds, dominating neutral, getting extra damage at every opportunity. But just one mistake can cost you. Oh, here it comes. Oh, my, you're gone. You're done. <laughs> That's two stocks within a minute from PSI guy. He's, you know, after an unfortunate start, already piling on this damage. Wants to go for a PK Thunder mix-up, but does not hit. Oh, and there's the Knight. It covers so much ground. It even goes a little bit off stage. It does, and it not only covers so much ground, it covers vertical distance as well. That's wild. You always think you're safe, and... You know, I'm, I'm floaty. I'm not going to be landing, but PSI guy forced to reconsider. Forward throw from PSI guy. Going for a couple of PK Thunders because you do want to condition your opponent to not expect that PK Thunder to hit yourself and end this game. Oh, my God. Just like that. You could tell he wanted it. <laughs> he was practicing that a little bit earlier today. He, he, he was like the first one in today as I was setting up, and that's the first thing he did. I think it's the first thing a lot of Ness players just go for. Yeah. Oh, the upbeat just trying to get him away. Another upbeat. No, he's able to actually DI a little bit off to the right and get the backer off that landing. Yeah, excellent work from PSI guy. After the first 30 seconds or so, I think that's about as one-sided of a match as you're going to see. Yeah. that Especially after such a strong start. You go into a match with such a strong start, like... I'm going to hit you with these backers. I'm going to hit you with all the shield pressure. I'm going to get you off stage. And then you SD. And then immediately as you respawn, you die in the first like 15 to 20 seconds. Like that, there goes all your momentum. All your momentum is done. Yeah, it's such a blow to the confidence. Yeah. So it's like you don't want to risk going for any, any crazy options anymore. Like you have to play as safe as humanly possible. Like even that up B, it was like that's a, that is a pretty standard kill. From Zelda. Yeah, in game two, we're going to be going to a variant of that Breath of the Wild stage, Fujin's home stage advantage. Oh, yeah. Something we don't necessarily have normally in the 2GG rule set, but. No, he created that, himself. It's, uh. Do we? You could do that. Yeah. There's, no, I mean within the normal stage list, but. Yeah, th there's still a couple of stages that you can't do just because of some right. Z axis shenanigans. Yes. But, no, this, this one's perfectly fine. Yes. This one's amazing. I recommend people do that a lot more. Like at, at 2 g events? Absolutely. You know, do that way more. Obviously, this is Nintendo sanctioned, so no music is off limits. When you have the opportunity to just go for a stage in a background, you know, that's a bit more unorthodox and uncommon, go for it. Yeah, I, I, need, I need some more, uh, I need some jump up superstar, like, in my life, man. Don't we all? Like, like just play, th play that in the Battlefield variant. It would change your life forward air from PSI guy will begin to just climb a 30% lead falling back air will extend it and PK Thunder just harassing Fujin off stage catches oh. him with the yo-yo and that sends Fujin straight to the top last zone. He, he even hit the stage and the game was just like adding insult to injury by saying oh yeah that's untackable yes it is <laughs> <laughs> so silly Collector from Zelda is such a useful tool in a matchup against oh, yeah. Ness and you know his swarm, his labyrinth of projectiles. Oh my god! That killed at 50%. <laughs> with a hundred with a little bit of rage. Yeah, Not all that much. conditioning paying off. Oh yeah. Oh, Ford's mask from Fujin finally in the first off. Two up air, three up airs in a row from PSI uh -oh, guy. Oh, don't do that. No, don't my do goodness. that. I was about to say, just be like, don't, please don't. Fujin, don't get hit by that. Yeah, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, that is potentially the end of the game. Great landing backer there. Another 
DK Thunder coming out. He wants it. He wants the Twitter clip. Forward smash, short Saying hop that back. Pin in tweet looking mighty empty right now. Oh, yeah. Man, I haven't gotten retweets on this for a while. <laughs> Meanwhile, the up smash will close it out in perhaps a much less dramatic, but, you know, equally valuable fashion for PSI guy. Yep. That's it, yeah. Clean two games set. Mm hmm. Coming out from PSI guy. Just all those PK Thunders just coming out, just doing all that 